Hey guys, welcome back. So in this video, we're going to talk about all international awards and honors that Kerala Tourism has received. So through this video, we're going to learn about not only the marketing efforts, the sustainable tourism practices or destination management efforts of Kerala, but also about the international organizations, international trade fairs in the sector of travel and tourism. So watch this video until the end. First of all, looking at this screen, you, you can see that there, there are very recent tweets from Kerala Tourism and WTM Responsible Tourism. Okay, so there was WTM World Travel Mart, World Travel Market that was happening in London. That happens every year. So uh, where this mission of Responsible Tourism, RT mission, that is uh, RT mission of Kerala that has got recognized a number of times from different organizations. Okay, it's it's around it's maybe it's fifth award for RT mission of Kerala. So they got to receive they got, they received this award uh, under the category showing the world that meaningful connections matter. You can say that on the award it is written that they are showing the world that meaningful connections matter. So what they were doing under RT mission, there are different entrepreneurs. They were sharing the stories. They were releasing audio series. They were producing video series. They were presenting to the world the video series and audio series during lockdown, during these pandemic times. They were connecting with people. So these videos not only, this, these videos got very good response and they were listened, they were watched. And for that, they got recognized at WTM World Travel Mart London uh, for the Responsible Tourism, WTM Responsible Tourism Award. So highly commendable as you can see on the tweet it is written. So it was given to Kerala for the work at home videos that were produced by RT Mission. Okay, Kerala God's own country has received many number of awards so far nationally, regionally. Okay, so we are here only going to talk about international awards and honors. So this video is limited to only international awards and honors that was received by Kerala. So very recently Kerala Tourism got the World Travel Mart for their work at home videos that were produced and presented during the lockdown uh, by Responsible Tourism Mission, RT Mission Entrepreneurs of Kerala. Okay, so that's very recent news news from WTM London. Talking about the awards and honors, we have the uh, UNWTO, the major organization, okay, the largest organization in travel and tourism, that is United Nations World Tourism Organization, UNWTO, and its Ulysses Award is the very prestigious award, okay, Ulysses Award, it got, uh, it, 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 uh, it gives honors for innovation in technology, research in technology, for uh, enterprises, for NGOs, for public policy and governance and Kumar Kom Responsible Tourism Project as I was talking about RT Mission. RT Mission is basically uh, Kerala, it, their idea of uh, establishing sustainable tourism practices or we can say the projects under triple bottom line people planet and profit that is economics sociocultural benefits and uh, physical environment so they were keeping in mind the physical sustainability that is environment their sustainability people their lifestyle their sociocultural uh, socioculture and community and the benefits economic benefits to the community okay and uh, that was the idea behind RT Mission, but it was actually uh, there were uh, different resorts set up. Okay, there were different establishments where people can come and visit and uh, enjoy their vacation, and that was not limited to these resorts. There were houseboats in these resorts, there were Ayurveda centers in these resorts, there were daily tours from these resorts to local villages, there were half day tour with the with the fisherman how to catch fishes and there were tours with people with farmers with with there were uh, women that were involved they they were selling the souvenirs the the uh, like the models of temples we have various temples uh, in kerala we have this shabrimala temple we and they were selling the snake boat model that is very famous snake boat that uh, race that happens in kerala in alapua alapua you can see the location of alapua here very famous snake boat race happens there's nehru boat trophy there that that is the uh, markable event that happens in kerala so these women were selling these models 
to the guests if they cost 2000 4000 5000 rupees okay depending on their size and quality so there were different souvenirs that were developed by by women by, by local community they were selling the people were doing pottery activities in nearby villages so they were really involved in in so tourism activities were not limited to the resorts and uh, five star hotels so the, the activities were uh, the, the local community get involved in tourism activities that was the basic idea behind RT mission and it got really recognized and it is really very very much functional there are different entrepreneurs of RT mission okay so there are various establishments of RT mission in 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 Kovalam in Vainar in Thekdi okay so number of uh, cities number of places number of destinations like Kumarkum the Kumarkum RT mission project there's a lake resort lake city resort where we have a houseboat also Ayurveda center also and daily tours that happen village experiences of Kovalam for that responsible tourism project of Kumarkam in 2013 got awarded UNWTO Ulysses award that is a very prestigious honor for any public policy governance or governance so they, they got recognized for innovation and public policy and governance UNWTO Ulysses award for Kumarkam responsible tourism project of 2013 okay that was about UNWTO Ulysses award talking about world travel and tourism council this is WTTC it is also a major organization it is a council of CEOs from all around the world so it is council of CEOs from around the world okay in travel and tourism sector so it is also major organization it get involved in research they present economic report every year so in the year 2018 they were they reported 185 countries from 25 regions the economic report of these many countries and 25 regions were presented by WTTC so if you go to their website you will find what what activities they are doing how they are uh, dealing with the, with the pandemic and how they are involved so they give this very prestigious award tourism for tomorrow award okay wttc tourism for of tomorrow award it was awarded to destination kerala in the year 2006 for it was given destination award to kerala in the year 2006 we also received in india ghe that is global himalayan expedition it's an expedition it's a it's a voluntary organization we can say that that organize different expeditions in high mountain ranges high mountain region of ladakh so ghe got tourism for tomorrow award in 2018 for their community efforts they what they did they set up solar energy grid solar energy grid to the villages in the high mountain region region of Ladakh so earlier in those villages those villages were they were not connected to electricity grid so this expedition GHE did the, these efforts to connect those villages to electricity they 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 established solar electricity solar energy grid to these villages so for that it got honored tourism for tomorrow award in the year 2018 that that is that Kerala tourism also received for destination award in the year 2006 talking about ghe they also received very recently during this pandemic award from unfcc united nation federation council on climate change unfcc okay they also honored their mission global himalayan expedition because it is about climate change and they set up uh, solar energy plants solar energy grid they connected villages to solar energy so they got recognized by unfcc also and they have received tourism for tomorrow war if you go to, if you learn about ghe if you go with them on an expedition you are really contributing to the society to the community they are doing these efforts for community so they also got tourism for tomorrow award ghe global himalayan expedition of ladakh talking about kerala not only wttc and unwto we have very famous itb berlin the leading world leading travel and trade show that is internationally tourism boards okay internationally tourism boards so itb berlin that happens in germany in berlin in berlin okay so they got they received these awards you can see one two three four five six awards they got in itb berlin that is das golden golden statue award das golden statue award for print campaign they got in 2014 for backwaters 
okay so there are different backwaters backwaters of alapua different backwaters are there in kerala okay so water uh, water water of this uh, we have this backwaters in kerala that is very um, attraction for tourism activities so their print campaign on backwaters of kerala got golden starter award at itb berlin international tourism boards and uh, golden starter award for ayurveda campaign they were really uh, kerala tourism was really keen in developing kerala as an ayurvedic destination they were they had this campaign of ayurbodh that is ayurveda bodh and uh, they got recognized in the year 2013 2012 for again print campaign they got silver for they got bronze for a tv commercial in 2011 for print campaign in 2007 they got golden starter award for commercial they got starter award in the year 2006 so they were continuously they were regularly getting these awards from itb berlin it berlin is the world is leading travel and trade show that happens in germany in in berlin okay so that is international tourism international international tourism boards in berlin okay talking about pacific asia travel writers association this is unwto affiliate member they also recognized kerala as a, as a leisure tourism for their leisure tourism activities or leisure tourism they got international award by pacific asia travel writers association that is a unwto affiliate member we have we have unwto unwto united nations world tourism organization it has it offers membership to different state parties to different organizations okay active members affiliate members so the, the, this specific area travel writer association is affiliate member of unwto and they awarded kerala in the year 2000 and 2001 international award for laser tourism talking about unesco their asia pacific heritage award asia pacific heritage award they gave to arakal ketu in kanur in kanur we have this museum or a fort this is very heritage uh, building so it was around 50 years uh, you know 50 years old so it was a very old building uh, arakal ketu in kanur you can see the location of kanur and arakel k2 so it's a museum it got awarded asia asia pacific heritage award by unesco unesco gives this award to to the private uh, private players private owners or individuals or ngos they, they are contributing to the uh, contributing to preservation of heritage to preserving the heritage so this arakel k2 was preserved so that it was given the asia pacific heritage award for arakel k2 in kanur we also got this same award of unesco asia pacific heritage award to leh leh town in ladakh was given this same award okay arakel k2 kanur has got 2000 in 2006 the asia pacific heritage award then we have new york ad festival and it was finalist award given to kerala tourism we have prague international advertisement festival where this this campaign your moment is waiting your moment is waiting campaign of kerala tourism its tvc got award in 2011 and its uh, print campaign got awarded in 2012 then we have world travel mart london that we talked about very first on first slide we talked about world travel mart world travel market london so they got best end award in 2011 best to uh, stand alone award in 2016 also and best rt mission that we talked about responsible tourism mission so responsible tourism mission got awarded for two consecutive years in 2017 and 18 by wtm london okay so that's about world travel mart london so they get that they get awards from wtm london also fitur is also a very uh, uh, famous or we can say the largest international exhibition best international uh, exhibition stand was given to kerala tourism pavilion in 2010 and it happens in madrid madrid is in spain you know the location of madrid you are near mediterranean sea okay so uh, madrid, in madrid in spain this fitur happens every year okay so it is also largest fair or we can say trade exhibition fitur so it is also very important so kerala tourism got this award also okay then we have smart travel asia they did this poll and uh, kerala was voted as the best 
Asian holiday destination in 2010 in the travel pod by Smart Travel Asia. We have IAA Olive Crown Award that was given to Kerala Tourism Sprint Campaign. Then we have CN Travel Award, Condonas, that Kerala Tourism Award Award for Best Excellence in Taking Brand India Global Award. Okay. Then we have Pata. Pacific Asia Travel Association. It is a major organization in Pacific region. It has various area chapters. India chapter, different area chapters are there in Pata. We have Pata membership to, to state parties, to travel agencies, to tour operators. So they have given different memberships also. They, they give these gold awards every year. So Pata, gold award for marketing human by nature. This is human by nature campaign of Kerala tourism. Okay. This is human by nature campaign. So it was basically an idea that we are not going to rope in any, any uh, cast that is any celebrity into the campaign. They casted their own people, the community, the farmers, the boat operators, the women, the entrepreneur, so local people, children and uh, people of Kerala. So this film was shot in real life location in real life scenario and real life cast was roped in and it was not a typical commercial the tone and treatment of this uh, you know commercial was not very like a commercial uh, like like commercial is it was shot by in in people so different people different community members different boat operators different farmers are shown in this video i will share the link and uh, the tone was not very commercial okay and this campaign human by nature was replaced this campaign has replaced this earlier campaign that your moment is waiting this was replaced by human by nature campaign and uh, i will share the link of human by nature campaign it's you can also find this campaign on Kerala tourism handle okay on Twitter uh, on Twitter and uh, this uh, campaign the basic idea is that there are no celebrities shown in this video there are no actors then that, that were uh, that, that were given the chance to show show that, that were shown in this commercial they were local people local farmers local children local women they were shown in this video and the scenario was also very much natural okay so that is human by nature campaign that was released recently last year and uh, it got awarded in 2020 this in september by pata pata gold award pata has given kerala tourism award i think every year in 2009 they received three awards for best website and one for travel advertisement for come out and play a campaign and for women empowerment that is ethnic restaurant at kumarkum kumarkum we can see the location of kumarkum it is just near to this vembanad lake this is vembanad lake it's a uh, it's the longest uh, lake in India and it is largest lake in Kerala and uh, near the, this is also a Ramsar site and uh, I, we have uh, created a video we have uh, posted a video on Ramsar sites of India and you can watch that also so Kumarkum is near to Vimbanar lake we also discussed here the Kumarkum responsible tourism project so here we have a ethnic restaurant that is run by women local women and it's an idea of women empowerment for that Kerala tourism got awarded by Bata last year in 2019 in 2019 they received three awards in 2018 they also got an award for travel advertisement for print media and travel poster for newsletter in 2016 they got for visit Kerala television commercial campaign they got uh, this award and uh, in 2015 Thekdi was given the award you can see the location of Thekdi here's the location of Thekdi Okay, so Thekri was also given award in 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 the year 2015 for Kumarkum Responsible Tourism Project that was re recognized by UNWTO. They also recognized this project in the year 2014. RT mission of Kumarkum. Okay, as we discussed earlier, the newsletter best website award they are very often getting awards they are getting award they got award for dream season in god on god own god's own country that's a marketing effort and uh, the, you can see 2009 10 11 13 14 15 16 16 18 so every year they are getting award 
uh, award almost every year they are getting award okay then they got award in 2008 for utsavam that's a kerala arts festival okay in 2008 they also got award for consumer travel brochure and arnamula cultural village there's a village cultural village that's a heritage village arnamula they got award for in the year 2007 arnamula cultural village that is near to Pedia. that is nearby this okay shabrimala temple we have and nearby this we have like the, the, there's this location of arnamula cultural village that is also a heritage village not only this we have kumbalam kumbalangi tourism village you can see kumbalangi tourism village so here you can experience village life so it is idea of rural tourism some some idea of rural tourism and community involvement basically you can see the location of Kumbal, Kumbalangi village so it is near to Kochi you can see the location okay so that is Kumbalangi village it was it was an eco tourism eco tourism project okay Kumbalangi tourism village so it is taken from their website you can if you are interested you can go to their website so they also get awarded in the year 2006 in 2006 they also got awarded for ayurveda the mantra of Nir niramya as i said that they are they were keen in developing tourism uh, ayurveda in kerala on global map are you both they got pensions for culture they got pensions for culture for ecotourism for ayurveda for marketing for heritage so they have been receiving awards from pata from 2002 you can see almost every year 2002 3 4 4 5 6 7 and there were more than one awards at at, at a time they were they were years when they got two three three awards okay on in the same year so these are the awards and honors kerala tourism has received from international organization international trade fairs in this video we learned about world travel mart about us and WTO Ulysses Award about WTTC, the Council of uh, CEOs of World, the Tourism for Tomorrow Award about ITV Berlin, the leading travel trade show that is International Tourism Boards of Berlin. Then Pacific Area Travel Writers Association. We learned about UNESCO Asia Pacific Heritage Award. We learned about WTM. We learned about Fitur, that is a major tourism fair in Spain. Okay. Then we learned about Pata and their awards. So Kerala is the favorite favorite uh, marketing or uh, organization, or we can say tourism organization for Pata. They have been giving Kerala award almost every year for their various campaigns various marketing strategies okay so that's the end of video i hope you learned something i hope you like this video thank you for watching this keep watching keep supporting have a great day